Hi, this is Bernard from Audio Kinetic. In this video, we'll be looking at uh, the music uh, segment editor and uh, we'll learn a few uh, shortcuts and uh, tricks. So, first, let's create a new segment in our project uh, by clicking the toolbar button New Segment. So, segment. Press Enter to inspect the segment but you'll notice right now uh, we don't see the segment so press F10 to go to the music layout uh, now we have an empty segment in our project uh, we will drag a few uh, wave files over the segment in the project explorer to get a few tracks created for us um, by default, the, the zoom uh, level of the segment may not be appropriate, so you, by holding the control key and by rolling, rolling the mouse wheel, we set the proper zoom. And by holding control and shift, we can set the horizontal zoom correctly. Another trick, by holding the Z key and left clicking the segment it zooms the segment editor to fit all the content next thing we're gonna do is adjust the entry and exit queue uh, for this segment the tempo is 142 42. and right now the the ruler is set in bar and beat that's what we want. Um, so we're gonna adjust the beginning uh, queue, the entry queue, and the exit queue for our for our segment. So when this segment is looping, only the portion between the entry and the exit queue will be played. The first time you play this segment, it will start at the beginning, then play the pre-entry, then play the content, and then loop. And when it quits, play the exit uh, portion of the segment. Um, next thing, we will create a new track for um, this, this segment. Um, so I'm going to zoom out a little bit and double click the, the empty area of our segment editor. This brings you the new track dialog, you name it, something, uh, base. And then what we'll do is by holding the control key and dragging an existing clip, create a copy of our clip. Um, next, uh, we will create again a new track, zoom out a little bit, double click to create a new track, call it guitar, and now we'll import a new uh, wave file from uh, by dragging the wave file directly in the track editor port. So you see uh, many ways to import copy uh, things in a segment editor. Now what we're gonna do is create a few uh, custom queues in our segment uh, so we can tell why which time in our segment uh, tenure can occur. So by holding the shift key and clicking the ruler it creates custom queues. So custom queues are sync point in time that can be used to sync tenures or transitions. So right now in the property editor we have no tenure associated with this segment. So we will create a new tenure uh, 
for this segment. So right now in my project, I have no trigger. The trigger is the object that we that you call in your game to um, to trigger our stinger. So call it new trigger, and I'll create a new segment in my project. Call it call it um, my stinger, and we'll select it by dragging it from the project explorer to the to the stinger tab and we'll say play this stinger at the next custom queue so that means if our cursor is there see so if if we are playing this segment and we are at this time and at this moment the new trigger is posted by the game the my stinger segment will play when it hit the custom queue next thing we're gonna do is look at random tracks um, so in our segment editor right click the the track editor here and you'll get this menu where you can select which kind of track you want is it random sequence or normal so we're gonna test the random one so random tracks a random track contains many one or many subtrack so let's add a few subtrack in our random track so this means each time this track is played wise we will randomly select one of the subtrack so let's resize this clip here like this and by using the control key drag the clip so that means so we'll, I, I'll remove uh, one track press the delete key on the track, track. so when I play this segment the first two tracks will be, will be always played and the third track wise will choose between one of them if you want to hear specifically one of the subtrack during authoring you just click the F key to force playback of that track so so you, you, you yeah one or the other um, so that's it we've been uh, looking at a few uh, tricks in uh, the segment editor I hope this was helpful and I see you in our next video